Hi guys. Um, first off, I would have to say affiliate marketing is basically free advertisement for um companies. Even if you don't buy something using the advertisement links, or basically anyone buy something using advertisement. The viewers basically seen it, and they can basically type in the the website to where the product is and buy it that way, or just go to a totally different um website. It's not worth it to affiliate marketing, honestly, in my opinion. Of eight years doing it, um, it's gonna become a lot of false hopes and stuff like that. Another thing I want to talk about is. You see all these people protesting, uh, like the beer company, Bud Light, stuff like that, because of the they spot a a trans person basically held the can or whatever. Yeah, the spokesperson basically held a can or whatever and made it for the trans people. I hate to break it to the people. You already bought the products. Just destroying it isn't gonna do anything to the company because they made money. Because they made money off the products that you bought already on top of you're giving them free advertisement and views, basically. So the people that didn't know what's going on, they basically just viewed their content and you just made the money. So it doesn't matter if you're destroying, like, with, with the Carhartt stuff going on, that went on. Um, You ruined your clothing that you already bought. Because you're not supporting Carhartt or whatever other company that's doing this. So you just wasted your money on products. Ripping up your clothing that you're going to have to go out and buy more of. And an inflation society of today. Good luck to you because clothing is not cheap like it used to be and my opinion if you're just gonna rip up stuff i highly suggest you go donate it to the homeless people the homeless shelter or basically any kind of shelter that is for those that need it or even the clothing stores that basically give back to the community give it to those who don't have much in this world who basically are in poverty every day. It doesn't matter if they go to work or they make such and such a month. It's not enough in this world. Give it to them. Let them have it. Give it to someone who actually needs it. Stop ripping up your clothing that you already paid for and give it to someone who needs it. I would be proud to have a Carhartt jacket. Or any kind of name brand stuff. You guys, I had it rough growing up. And I got it rough now. You guys don't know this. But um, I, I know what it's like to have hand-me-down clothing. Hand-me-down game machines. Hand-me-down anything. One of our places that we shopped at a lot was the thrift store. If that doesn't tell you something, then I don't know what to tell you. We looked forward to the clothing closets for the schools whenever we were in school. We looked forward to being able to find our clothes cheap enough so we can pay bills and have food over our, on our table and a roof over our head. That's basically what I'm saying. If you don't support the said company anymore, then give it to someone else who needs it or wants it. I don't understand why everyone is wasting their money going out buying said things that they're no longer buying or they no longer support. Like the car hearts, you guys are paying them money to basically rip it up, tear it up, burn it, whatever. Give it to somebody who wants it or needs it. That's just all I'm saying. We live in a world where it is divided and basically, um, no one is looking out for anyone anymore. We live in a world where racism, racism is still there. And look at it now. The trans community 
no offense to you guys there, there's nothing wrong i love each and every one of you guys i love everyone in general i'm a talking unicorn for pete's sake um <laughs> look at it they're dividing us because of the gender our gender our skin our looks everything our bodies they're, they're dividing us what whatever they feel like dividing us with it was racism now it's something totally different sex all this stuff but you, you guys see where it's going right they're just dividing us even more and it sucks living in america at this point because there's no help for any of this you're just gonna keep dividing keep dividing until basically we don't know what's gonna happen or we already know world war three is gonna happen but you guys see it right there's just so much going on between the oil spills not the oil spills what the hell do what i said the, the fucking train derailments the train derailments the factories burning there's just so much going on and now they brought something out to basically furthermore it, it, it's just too much going on we just all gotta stand by each other love one another and basically be there for each other because as you can see it, it's just too much but i'm that's gonna be the end of this video and i will come back with something totally different to talk about but when is it gonna end when is this like division segregation stuff gonna end <coughs> we, we were we're supposed to love each other and be there for one another but at this point look at everything that's going on you got people burning clothes you got people tearing up stuff you got people all this stuff going on but that's just something for you guys to think about and actually look through another lens in life and see everything that's going on instead of what you're being told but yeah that's all bye guys